What's going on guys, it's Mesmar here and welcome to a brand new video. So what we're going to be doing today, as you can see from the title, we are going to be opening our NAT type on the uh, Call of Duty World War 2 PC version. So if you follow these steps, uh, you'll be able to open your NAT type no problems. Okay, so what we want to do from here is uh, once you're on the, the desktop, all you want to do is just press the Windows key or you can just go down the bottom here to type. Um, and what you want to do is actually just type in uh, network and this will open up control panel. Um, and I'll just drag that over here. There, here we are. And then uh, make sure you change it to category. You'll be able to get a bit more of a... Uh, you know, subheading exactly like how mine is. Uh, the way you want to, you'll want to go to network and internet, and then view network or computers and devices uh, on your network. The other way to get here is to actually just open up uh, your file browser. So you can actually see this one here. Um, then you go to network, and you'll be able to see the exact same page. Um, but once you're here, you should see under network infrastructure, basically uh, this. Uh, your router so what you'll need to do is right click on this and go properties now this part can take a, a little bit a uh, little bit of time to load just because of uh, how many processes are in um, the thing already port forwarded so what you want to do is just go settings and then from here it should pop up this little menu here and uh, what you'll need to do is just go add um, and then you can call it whatever you like I generally will go call of duty uh, World War II PC and then uh, from here you will want to actually go um, to here and type in CMD. Uh, the other way you can get to this is by pressing and holding the Windows key as well as the letter X and then you let go of it and it opens this. Then you can actually open, uh, just press A um, and on the new Windows Creators Update and uh, on Pro, Windows 10 Pro, um, it'll open up PowerShell. So this is exactly like Command Prompt, the, uh, the exact same way. If you're more familiar with Command Prompt, uh, once again, you just uh, close this one down. Uh, then go to um, open up this, go CMD, and it'll open up your Command Prompt, and we're back with Familiar. Uh, so what you'll need to do is IP config. Um, you can do slash all if you like, but probably easiest just to do that then what you will need is your IPv4 address. So on Windows 10, you can actually just drag uh, this one here and then Control c to copy. Then from here, you can actually just Control v straight in. So keep this number copied at all times, um, whether you add a sticky note on the desk or something like that. Um, then from here, you're actually going to need a separate web page. So I'll just bring that up on screen for you. Okay, so here we are. Um, so this, I'll leave this link in the description of the video if you want to. There's all of these right now. Um, so uh, these can be updated once the game, um, you know, once they figure out the exact ports. Most of these are the generic ports that you would need. So for PC, you can see we're going to be doing these ones. So we need the standard 3074. So all you need to do, 3074, take that one, chuck it in here. We can see we're doing the um, TCP right now, TCP, so we just keep that selected on TCP and the internal port will be the exact same and that's all you need to do. So um, that should help you uh, get from like a strict or moderate to hopefully open. If you even, even if you go from strict to moderate, that's better than nothing. Um, if you need to, uh, you can go through and actually do these steps. Uh, so I'll use this as an example, this 27015. Uh, you actually just copy paste this one uh, into that same same location. So I'll just open this up again. Uh, go add and uh, you can go COD w, uh, World War Two PC. Um, once again, you'll need this. So keep this open. That's why I said keep this handy. Um, so you'll actually need to find your one. So don't don't just be using uh, my one because my one won't be the exact same uh, same uh, IP as what yours would be because mine's a different location on my network. Uh, so then you will need this uh, 27015, uh, so you can copy paste that one or just type it in whichever way. It's still uh, TCP, so you need to do 27015 uh, again. Now what you'll need to do is, you can see that this is all the way to 30. You can manually put these in one by one. The other way you can do it is uh, by actually getting your default gateway just there. So this one here, this is pretty standard. This will be generally everyone's default gateway. You can actually copy paste, put that into your router. 
um, into your browser, any any browser, and will actually log into your router. The default password for most is admin admin or something like that, but if you set your own up, you'll have to uh, work that one out yourself. Um, if not, you can contact your ISP and see if you can um, figure out uh, maybe what the uh, router login password is. It should be on the bottom of the router if you're not f uh, familiar with it. But yeah, um, figure that one out because then you can actually go through um, and actually add it on the uh, uh, interface page for that itself. Um, but realistically, you know, 3074 is the most common one, so make sure that's added. Um, and then the same for UDP, so just uh, go add, um, fill all that in, and just click UDP at the same time. But yeah, that's all you need to do. Um, yeah, and then hopefully from there, um, you should be right to go. So yeah, you can uh, once that's all done, you can actually close all that down. Um, yeah, and then hopefully that gives you the best uh, best performance um, for Call of Duty World War Two on PC. Um, so yeah, once again, this is Mesma, um, and I'll be posting a fair few videos. So um, yeah, if you liked this video, give it a thumbs up, or yeah, even subscribe to the channel because uh, yeah, there's there'll be uh, you know the Xbox and and PS uh, PS4 one if you've got it on uh, different consoles. So yeah, give those videos a check out, and yeah, um, I'll see you in the next video.